everyone welcome back to the channel MLD lectures in this video we will learn about a special biochemical test that is coagulase test which is used to differentiate between staphylococcus aureus which is coagulase positive from coagulase negative organisms before moving towards the video please subscribe the channel why this test is done the test is used to differentiate staphylococcus aureus which is coagulase positive from coagulase negative staphylococcus species now we'll see the principle of coagulase test coagulase test staphylococcus aureus produce an enzyme called coagulase which can act upon the fibrinogen and form a fibrin clot. Staphylococcus aureus produce two kinds of coagulase that is bound and free. First, we'll see uh, the bound coagulase. This bound coagulase is bound to the bacterial cell which can directly act upon the fibrinogen which result in the precipitation of fibrinogen causing the cells to come. Whereas the free coagulase is not bound to the bacterial cell wall. So they are mixed with the plasma and they are incubated. After incubation they form a coagulase reacting factor which is modified or a derived thrombin molecule. Then it forms a complex called coagulase CRF complex. This complex in turn react with the fibrinogen to produce a fibrin clot. To do this test, we need a quality control. So, for positive organism, we take Staphylococcus aureus and for negative organism, we take Staphylococcus epidermis. There are two ways to determine coagulase test. They are slide test and tube test. Now let us discuss about slide test. First, place a drop of coagulase plasma. We normally take a rapid plasma on a clean and dry glass slide. Then, in the other slide, Place a drop of distilled water or a saline. It acts as a control. Then emulsify a portion of isolated colony being tested in each drop. Then try to make a smooth suspension. Mix it with the wooden applicator stick. Rock gently for 5 to 10 seconds. In the result, we can see clumping if it is positive and no clumps are seen if the test is negative. Macroscopic clumping in 10 seconds or less in coagulated plasma drop and no clumping in saline or water drop. Likewise, for negative, no clumping in either both the drop. Now tube test. Emulsify a several colonies in 0.5 ml of rapid plasma to give a milky suspension. Then incubate the tube for 35 to 37 degrees Celsius for 4 hours. After 4 hours check for clot formation. Result for test positive we can see clot formation. The clot can be of any size. For negative test, there is no clot formation. Thank you. Hope you like the content. Do check the other biochemical test. The link is given below in the description box. Please like, share and subscribe the channel.